Now, some people would say, well, if God is so great and God is this, this being that you describe, how possibly can human beings have any type of connection or relationship with the Creator? You see, most people fall into one or two mistakes when it comes uh, in respect to God. Either people imagine that in order for us to have some connection or relationship with God, God needs to become a human being. God, they imagine God as some finite created form. And this this is, this is anthropomorphizing God. This is making God like some created thing. And this is really not befitting, this is not befitting to the majesty and the splendor of God at all. For God is far from becoming a human, becoming a human being or, becoming so, or being like some finite created thing. On the other hand, the other extreme is that people imagine that God is if there is a God, they will say, well, God is some remote, you know, being, master being that's created everything and just left us. He doesn't care about us. He doesn't care uh, about our lives. He's just left us and, and that's it. And, and how can you possibly have a relationship with such a, such a being? But this is also imposing a type of limitation on God based upon our own human limitations. In reality, we can have a relationship with God. We can have a connection with God. But I want to say something. I want to make some, you know, like a caution. When I say connection, when I say relationship, these are just human terms for what we experience. And I want to give you an example. You've probably maybe heard an example like this before. If, if, if I ask you to describe to me a mango, what is a mango like? you're very, very limited in how you can describe the taste of a mango. You can say it's sweet, maybe you can descri describe the texture of the flesh of the mango, but in reality, what you can tell me about the actual taste of the mango is very, very limited. And this is also true when it comes to trying to describe that connection or that relationship that we human beings can have with God. We call it a connection, we call it a relationship, but it is actually in reality something very unique that you have to experience.